Italy's Campi Flegre supervolcano is active. Could this seismic giant be about to erupt? In Greek and Roman mythology, the Campi Flegre volcano was depicted as the entrance to the underworld. Its prehistoric eruptions blocked out sunlight, turned summer into winter, and covered Europe and Russia in thick volcanic ash. Now, this powerful seismic giant near Naples is stirring again, shaking the ground in a way scientists say hasn't happened in centuries. The two most recent earthquakes were the strongest we've ever seen, said Giovanni Macedonio, director of the National Institute of Geophysics and Volcanology in Naples. Earthquakes in March and June of this year, caused by Campi Flegre, forced people to evacuate, and there are dozens of families who cannot return to their homes because of the damage. To keep everyone safe from the eruption, more than half a million people must be evacuated from the area that Italian authorities have designated a red zone around the eight-mile-wide Campi Flegre crater. Here, Macedonio said, there are absolutely no precautions to protect oneself from pyroclastic flows of volcanic particles and ash, superheated at about 1,472 degrees Fahrenheit that would cover the terrain at speeds between 30 and 60 miles per hour. The Campi Flegrai volcano is considered a national threat because of its explosive style of eruption, which scientists say can create an eruption column, a kind of cloud of dust and ash that can rise up to about 18 miles into the sky and be carried by the wind. When the column of dust and ash finally falls, its weight can even collapse roofs on houses. At the observatory, Macedonio oversees in Naples, a large red telephone is connected directly to the civil protection headquarters in Rome. The line is tested twice a day. Vesuvius, the most famous volcano in the area, 
whose pyroclastic flows froze the ancient Roman city of Pompeii in time, looms east of Naples. Hans Christian Andersen, after witnessing the eruption in 1834, described the lava as colossal falling stars. But in reality, the Campi Flegre, or Phlegrean fields, from the Greek phlegraios, meaning fiery, far less visible underground, are potentially catastrophic. This is because hundreds of thousands of people currently live directly above the volcano, in an eight-mile-wide crater left by a past eruption. We all know that we live in a very earthquake-prone area, said Madalena de Sario, a Naples resident whose neighborhood sits on the edge of the Campi Flegre caldera. In the ancient city of Pozzuoli, situated on the caldera, tourists follow guides through narrow, winding alleys. From the hilltop, they gaze out over the curving bay, the sea sparkling in the sun under a bright blue sky, and the island of Capri, the playground of the wealthy, in the distance. But this extraordinary beauty belies the dangers that lie here. During the volcano's largest eruption, about 39,000 years ago, Campi Flegre ejected 72 cubic miles of molten rock, according to Macedonio of the National Institute of Geophysics and Volcanology. Global temperatures plummeted, and all of what is now Europe, as well as parts of Russia, were covered in volcanic ash. Some scientists suggest that the eruption may have contributed to the complete extinction of the Neanderthals. <laughs> 